Hey guys, it's your girls, Twin Goddesses. I'm Alicia. Hello. Anyways, um, I'm doing <clears throat> Ooh. I'm doing another video. This hair piece I actually picked out to wear during the fall. I don't know, I just thought it was kind of cute. And um, I got this one from Hair with Harlem. It is from the Vivica Fox Hair Collection. And this one is called Rachel V. And I got it in the color 1B. It is a lace front wig made from 100% Pretoria fiber, so it can be flat iron or curling, curled. And it also has a baby hairline, as well as pure stretch cap. And this is a part of the deep collection that Vivica Fox has. There is no picture on the package, so I'll link a picture in the video. Or okay, so here is the unit. It has loose curls at the bottom and kind of straight at the top. I already cut off the lace, but in this unit, as far as the construction, it comes with three combs, two at the temple, one in the center, and one comb in the back, as well as um, adjustable straps. And as far as parting, this is a part of their deep collection, and before I even had the chance to try um, one of Vivica Fox's lace fronts. I didn't know what the heck the deep meant because it's like deep. So I'm thinking, okay, must have like eight inches of parting space or something. No, but anyways, the parting that you get is you get like maybe I don't know, like an inch, an inch and a half of party parting space. And then if you see this area right here, it's because they attached it along. this like partation here so you only get a designated area of parting space I mean you can still get that one inch anywhere but for the deep parting space you only get a designated area so bummer you can't strategically part this anywhere and get that deep space. It's only going to be here, which is pretty much located. It looks like it's a bit on the right side of your temple, like right here. Anyways, the hair is quite soft. Um, this 1B looks like a 1. It looks jet black. It looks almost like a blue black to me. So if you are a normal 1B, I would definitely go up a color, like maybe to a number 2. Okay, so Vivica Fox um, lace front wigs do tend to fit a bit petite on the head. <clears throat> it has a bit of a petite um, fit. I don't know what it is. The last few wigs I've gotten have been a bit small. So... I don't know what that is. Maybe my head's just getting huge, and I don't know. That's not a good thing. But when I first got the wig, it had a wig hump here, or um, because of that that skin partition that they give you. I got my wig. I took it out, noticed it, and I put it upside down on a uh, mannequin head, and I had it there for like a week. I had this week, this hair sitting here for about a week, and it's still a little bubble. Um, definitely if you do this don't do what I did just put it on the mannequin head definitely spray it with some leave-in conditioner inside out therefore that leave-in conditioner can help soften not only the hair but the um, the partation area and then you turn it inside out and it could go away that way look at the parting space again like I said you get that inch that naturally comes Anywhere you part the wig at, um, from ear to ear, you get that inch. And then, um, then they, they claim deep. And they give you another inch, or another inch and a half of a part of the hairline. Um, Y'all, I'm telling you, 
I don't know. I think my head's getting bigger because I haven't been able to fit like the last five wigs I purchased. I haven't been able to fit it. So I don't think it's the wig. I think it's me. That's not a good thing. But anyways, this is what the hairline is looking like. Um, the density on this could be a lot better. I'm going to show you guys all angles of the hair. And this hair is around, I'd say around um, 16 inches long. You guys, it. Sorry guys, my camera just shut off on me. So anyways, like I was saying before I was rudely interrupted. Um, this is the length. As you can see, it's a very modest length. Like I said, it's around 16 inches long. Again, I got this from Hairwig Harlem. I'll leave all the information down below so you can check it out. I'll have the price and everything down below. Also, if you would like to know the longevity and how this hair holds up and a more in-depth review on the current status of this hair and the ending status of this hair, please check out our blog. It's going to be in there within a week or so after I've worn this wig out. Again, this is Rachel V in the color 1B. Real cute, real classy. Let me know what you guys think. Okay, you guys. Talk to you guys later.